Hello guys, KB Tasmania here and we need to speak to the sergeant. So let's go ahead and speak to him. Um Susie Griffinbane is down on Triton Avenue asking for help. But we're spread thin with all the problems in Wizard City. I think her brother is lost or something like that. Can you help her out? Okay, we are gonna go ahead and do Triton Avenue first and then we'll do more quests after in fire cat and psychops lane and also um wait let's go ahead and head on towards trident avenue okay so halloween's tomorrow yep that's exciting um i'm gonna be dressing up like the joker and so i don't know what i'm gonna do yet but yeah the joker Okay, so let's go ahead and speak to Susie. So glad you came. I've been trying to get someone to help me, but the guards are far too busy with all the events of late. The headmaster sent you? Great! My brother and I can use the help. We are trying to stop all the undead that broke down the gate from the haunted cave and invaded the area. My brother Arthur went on ahead to check out the haunted cave. He had a theory that the force behind all this was in that cave. I'm worried because I've not heard from him for a while. Could you go see how my brother is doing? He should be just inside the haunted cave. Maybe he's identified the dark presence responsible for Wizard City's troubles. Okay, so now we need to go find Susie's brother um, in Haunted Cave. So let's go ahead on and head on over there and see what he is up to. We're not going to want to speak to Baldy for a while and there's a wooden chest for me I'm not keeping track of the wooden chest but I think that's like my 11th one um okay so there's some scarlet screamers and some zombies damn zombies um wizard city's infested with the undead and there is trident Look, and this is so empty. Should get off the streets. Okay. So let's go ahead and enter the haunted cave. You find a broken wand just inside the haunted cave. Uh oh. Okay, so let's go back to speak to Susie. We came all the way this way just to pick up that wand. That was broken. Okay. Um let's go ahead and go around. Scarlet Screamers don't want to get in a battle. At least not yet. Let's go ahead and head back. Probably should have marked it. It's a bad habit not marking the places that I need to go. Even though in Pirates I keep saying that I need to mark it. but Or a marker. And now that I'm playing Wizards, I'm not even marking them. So that is no good. Okay. So four fall mills. Susie, Susie, your brother needs help. He's not there. I found his wand though. That could help you out. Did you find him? This is his wand. Something must have happened to him. I'll bet he was right about the haunted cave as being the source of evil. Could you talk to Duncan Grimwater? He is a death student studying the events here, trying to piece together what is going on. He's a little snobbish, but he might have a clue as to my brother's whereabouts. Can you check with him, please? Okay, so now we need to speak to Duncan Grimwater, who is a death wizard. Merle Ambrose sent another student to help out? I guess he thinks that Susie and her brother cannot handle this situation. Well, that's what happens when you send Storm students to do a death student's job. Hey dude, I'm Storm. Susie says that her brother is missing? Ha! I think he is hiding back at Ravenwood. But I'll check around and see what I can find out. In the meantime, I could use some help with my field studies. I need to find out the fighting tactics of the undead. Knowing how they fight may give me some insight into how we can defeat them. I would do it myself, but... Uh... I just ran out of treasure cards. It shouldn't be too hard. Just defeat some haunted minions and rotting fodders. Report back to me afterwards. What a liar. Run out of treasure cards? I thought Storm Wizards can do a Death Wizards job. So let's go ahead and fight some haunted minions. 
which shouldn't be too hard. And also, um, oh, we have storm bats. Let's go ahead and test that out. Okay. Storm bats, storm bats. Pretty good attack, 259. Not too shabby. Okay, so um, I'm gonna go ahead and cut ahead until where I defeat five. Because it's just gonna be me doing storm bats. So let's get to it. Okay, so I'm back after we defeated the hunting minions. So now we need to go ahead and defeat some zombies. And also, you may have noticed Timothy Legend Friend. Um, he, he is one of my subscribers on YouTube and he wanted to play alongside me. So um, I'm all for it. If anybody else would like to play alongside me and help me during these quests, um, feel free to send me a message um, the only thing I would require is that you're one of my subscribers and that you have at least text chat open chat would be better but text chat is fine um, if you have muted chat I don't like talking to muted people because it may be hard to give orders like later on in battles so yeah not really a muted fan okay so we need to go ahead and defeat some zombies and Timothy is the life wizard level 53 or 2 rather and he's gonna be helping me out in this episode so zombies, yeah, using storm against storm, not the best best idea, but it's all I got for now. Ooh, mid shield. Too bad I don't have a mid attack, son. Dryad, it's a tree with a trunk. Ooh, fizzle. Why is Storm Beetle keep fizzling? That is no cool. Um, very, very, very. I don't want those. Ooh, okay. Come on, zombie. With the shovel. Did he dig his way out of the grave? What, who, who buries somebody with the shovel? Who does that? Nobody's supposed to bury somebody with a shovel. Then they could dig themselves out. And we killed the zombies. So we need to go ahead and defeat four more zombies. So let's go ahead and do that off screen. I'm going to go ahead and cut ahead until where we defeat these zombies. Alright, see you guys after. Okay, so I am back after I defeated those zombies or if you want to call them rotting fodders and I am almost out of man no that is no good so I'm going to go ahead and teleport down here ooh cattails cattails and it will help if I don't get stuck I'm always getting stuck on random stuff that Reagents gets in my way in your bag, be quiet which you can shush the crafting tab in your Duncan shelf, wants to speak by dude on your keyboard. quiet my time. Okay, Duncan. You survived? I mean, that was fast. Those undead are not as tough as they seem, are they? So what did you learn? What? The undead were using storm magic? That doesn't make any sense. Where could they have learned that? Hmm. Maybe you could ask Susie what she might know about this. And tell her I'm still trying to find out what happened to her brother. Okay, so now we need to go speak to Susie. Huh? And why is Duncan so surprised? I got this, I'm Storm. Storm's the best. Okay, so Susie. Or the strongest rather. Okay. What? Duncan needs my help? Wow, that's a first. Duncan is right. You don't normally find the undead using storm magic. Someone must have put them up to this, but who? I have seen them wearing some kind of strange medallion. 
Battle some rotting fodders and collect these, then take them to Duncan. Maybe he will know why the undead have them. Okay, so we need to go defeat some more zombies. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut ahead until where I defeat these zombies. I see you guys after. Okay, so I am back after we defeated some zombies and collected storm medallion. So now we need to go ahead and speak to Duncan Grimwater. You collected these from the rotting fodders? Great! This will help me out! Where could the undead have gotten storm medallions? In order for me to investigate these medallions, I will need some Lumina Crystals. They store storm magic and will be affected by the medallions. To get some Lumina Crystals, you will need to go see Vlad Raveneye, the miller by the falls. He runs the storm mill that produces the Lumina Crystals. Oh look, a wooden chest. Yay. Okay, I need to go speak to Baldi. Okay. Um. Oops. Okay. Baldi, what do you have in store for us? Hello, Baldi. You are here investigating these events with all the undead? Ooh ha! It's about time something was done about them. They're scaring all the citizens away. Citizens. Um. I sure am glad to see a fresh face. The undead have brought a. We need to build some. First thing we'll need is some cloth to make the scarecrows. That's the wrong one. The cloth can be collected off of. You need some Lumina crystals for your investigation? Yes. Why, I'd give you some. But my entire inventory was taken by the undead. If you can get over to the street and take back my barrels, I will gladly share them with you. Okay, so, um, dude interrupted me while I was walking away. Even though it's rude to walk away when somebody's talking, but I'm doing the main quest only, sir. Sir Baldy. Okay. So, pick up barrels and collect aluminum crystals. Where are barrels? Barrel, barrel, barrel. Or it's like, um, Pirates 101 where we have to collect, collect cask, um, or the gunpowder. Not gunpowder, it was cask in the first dungeon. And I forgot to mark the place once again. Ah, uh, see, I'm getting so used to pirates that I don't mark it, and I have to walk all the way back. Do 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 do. Ah, uh, Timothy. Um. Do 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 do. Ah, dude, Baldy, why are you so far away? So far away. Okay. Got a light? I don't believe it. These Lumina crystals you brought me have been drained of magic. I'll bet those undead have a way of stealing the power from them. The power of light. Crystal clear. You take this crystal back to Duncan. I'm sure he'll want to see this. Ow. Dude, stop it. Okay, so let's go ahead and go speak to Duncan. Grimwater. Duncan, what is up? The undead are able to steal magic from the Lumina Crystals? They are too dim-witted to know how to do this on their own. Someone must be helping them. We still need a charged Lumina Crystal to find the source of the Storm Medallions. Defeat Scarlet Screamers until you find a fully charged Lumina Crystal. Then return it to me so we can finish the investigation. Okay, sir. So let's go ahead and go defeat some Scarlet Screamers. A new enemy that we have not fought yet. But we have seen they are um myth. And looks like Timothy is already ahead of me and fighting one. Okay. Let's see. Myth. Um actually Storm gets a boost from Myth. So I'm gonna be killing him pretty fast. And the Storm Bat does 245 anyways then he only has 3 or 235 okay I got jacked for my kill <laughs> it's okay um the zombie wasn't supposed to get in this battle hopefully I get the aluminum crystal uh, not aluminum or aluminum light hopefully I get the light crystal Okay. Ow. And also, I am gonna fizzle. Awesome. Even though I got a um, 
a charm on me. Uh, okay, um, come on. I have so much pips. 500 health, 504 health are ready. Yay. Timothy. Ooh, 135. And I fizzled again. What is up with that? That is not cool. Come on. I don't like all these fizzling. Actually, what level am I? Level am, I? am I five? Six? I think I'm five. Probably could get some new armor. Uh, maybe. And I fizzled again? Are you serious? Come on, fizzling. Stop. No fizz. No more fizz. Fizz is not allowed. Come on, I wanna kill him already. We don't even need to fight this. Okay, I'm gonna do a wand attack. Wand attack. Ooh, a lot of waiting. Okay. <laughs> Doing a little dance. Mm, good boy. A thousand two hundred and twenty-six. That's a lot. Okay, seventy-four finally. And we did not collect the Luma Crystal, so I'm gonna go ahead and collect it off-screen, so you don't have to see me fight a whole bunch of. Um, Scarlet Screamer so see you guys after okay so I am back after we went ahead and defeated those Scarlet Screamers and collected the Luma Crystal and I also gained some new armor a robe and um, a hat a hood okay so let's go ahead and speak to Duncan you got the crystal from the Scarlet Screamers great now we can figure out what's going on here and especially who is behind this. Duncan waves his wand over the Lumina Crystal and the Storm Medallion. Magical electricity arcs from the medallion, and an image appears in the crystal. Of course! Go tell Susie Griffinbane that the undead on Triton Avenue are being led by the Harvest Lord, and that he has captured her brother. Oh, the Harvest Lord. Okay, so let's go ahead and go speak to Susie. My brother's been captured? We have to save him! Oh no! I'll bet that when Arthur was scouting the haunted cave, the undead kidnapped him! He's probably at the Harvest Lord's tower right now! Please, if you defeat the Harvest Lord, you'll not only save my brother, but you may stop all of the haunting on this street! Okay, I need a mark. Okay. Let's go ahead and go defeat the Harvest Lord, because he is causing mayhem in Trident Avenue, and I need to put a stop to it. Alright, so Harvest Lord, we are coming to defeat you. There's nobody gonna stop me. Nothing's gonna get in my way. No greater force is greater than I am. I'm gonna go defeat you. I just motivated myself up, and here we go! Ah! A long walk. Okay. Harvest Lord, do you think you're better than I am? There is some miswood. I'm gonna go enter your domain. Alright, here we go. In the back of the room, you notice Arthur, Susie's brother. So, wizard, you too have uncovered Malastare's plan. Too bad you will have to remain here with the other wizard. The both of you will be powerless to stop us. Soon the undead will drive out all the citizens and take over the rest of the city. And with the school in our hands, we will rule Wizard City. Ambrose will at last be crushed. <laughs> <laughs> with your evil laugh, okay. Like I said, I'm gonna put a stop to your mayhem that you have been putting along Wizard City and I didn't get the card, card that I needed. Um, let's go ahead and discard these. And what we're gonna wanna do is, I guess let's go for their 
Harvest Lord first. Storm Beetle, yay! Ooh, 133. Pretty good. Okay. Um, what are you gonna do? Oh, uh, Myth Bat. Thought you were gonna do a Myth Shield. That's probably what your minion is gonna do. And nope! I guess I was wrong. He's doing a death attack because he is Storm. The zombie should have been death. Because zombie, dead, undead. He is the undead. Okay, let's see if I could go ahead and kill the Harvest Lord. Yes, no fizzle. Okay, let's see. Come on. And no, I didn't. Probably has like so little health left. Like two. Or like three. No, I said two first. Let's see. Two. Two. One. Oh, even worse. That's not cool. Um. Let's go ahead and wand you. I can't believe it was just one. I hate when that happens. It doesn't happen that often, but when it does, it sucks. <laughs> what if I would have died because of that one? It would have been that one health. I would have died. That's not cool. Um, let's go ahead and do lightning bats. Come on, die! Yay! Okay, so we defeated the Harvest Lord. So let, we need to go speak to Thank Arthur. Thank you for freeing me, my friend. I feared that no one was ever going to find me. Please, go and tell my sister that I am safe. I know I have worried her so. May the winds of chance bring us together once more, wizard. Aren't you gonna come? Why, why are you gonna stay here? Dude, come! Come with me! Take a ride. Come on. You don't wanna ride in my mount? Oh, is it because I don't have a two-person mount? Is that it? Is that it? Dude! Is that it? Don't tell me that's why. You're mean. Okay, let's go ahead and teleport back. And Susie. You saved Arthur from the Harvest Lord? Thank you, young wizard. I don't know what I would have done had I lost him. You'd better tell the headmaster what has happened here. He needs to be informed on what's happening in Wizard City. Okay, so let's go ahead and not I don't want to equip that. Um, let's go ahead. Oh, it seems like we need to go back to our stone teacher because he has a new spell for us. Um, and then we will go speak to Headmaster Ambrose. What do you got for us? Oh, you got actually a quest for us. Um, okay. So, you want to do some research, huh? Great. Librarian Harold Argleston needs a Leyden jar. He's been doing a lot of experiments lately. The task at hand is to build one. Go to Lady Oriole and get some copper for the lining. Is this a side quest or is this to get... Uh, quest. I mean a card. I don't know. So I'll go ahead and decline that. And let's go ahead and go speak to Headmaster Ambrose. And I will find out if that's for a card. Because I'm, I'm not trying to do side missions. At least not yet. Like in Pirates, uh, how I didn't do no side missions. Okay. So Headmaster Ambrose... What do you got in store for us? Ooh, Gladden Report. By Bartleby, you defeated the Harvest Lord? Ooh, not many students can make that claim. Good work, young wizard. The Harvest Lord mentioned that he was helping Malastair. We need to find out what Malastair's plans are. If Wizard City is ever to return to the nice place it once was, it's hard to run a school with all the monsters running amok. <laughs> There's like an echo. Many thanks to you for straightening everything out on Triton Avenue, young wizard. I fear the worst is not over yet. Haha, <laughs> I know, dude. Okay, so in the next episode, we are going to go speak to the sergeant once again. And we are going to start by Cat Alley. Alright, so see you guys in the next episode. I'm out. Peace.